are awesome. It challenges you and it gives you strength to go on. There's advanced techniques even for more experienced people. It helps me to put all the perspective together when I decide a new clinical trial in the future. Welcome to the first day of Europe PCR 2017. Good morning, dear colleagues, dear companions, dear friends. I wish you a warm welcome home. Europe PCR has grown to become a platform for exchange and networking. So let's enjoy this special edition of Euro PCR. Um, I wish all of you a happy 40th anniversary. We'll celebrate it throughout the course. Thank you, and shall we do? Composite of all cause mortality, stroke, life-threatening, and major We did a uh, large, multi-center, prospective, randomized, head-to-head -head comparison of the Lotus valve and core valve. Uh, we demonstrated uh, non-inferiority for safety with a composite endpoint at 30 days and superiority for effectiveness. A course like this is more important than ever. A dedicated program for nurses and allied professionals in interventional cardiology, developed by and for nurses and allied professionals, is part of the Euro PCR 2017 course. So it's a pleasure for us on behalf of the board to announce that the uh, 2017 Ethica Awardee is Dr. John Olmsten. When I look at the people who've won it in the past, uh, I'm really overawed by these people. They've been such leaders in, in cardiology and they've done so many fabulous things. And, uh, to think I've won the award is pretty overwhelming. A major achievement is uh, altering how certain techniques are done uh, from the information we have achieved by doing bench testing of devices. So we've learned a lot about how devices work and how best to, to use them. And I think that's my biggest achievement. Learning sessions at EuroPCR are practical and interactive. They're based on exchanges in practice and attendees learn in a step-by-step -step fashion. I think the format is excellent, it was interactive, which was very important. They engaged the audience and they strongly encouraged them to participate in the discussion. It goes uh, step by step from uh, diagnostic uh, to assessing uh, bifurcation of the lesions, what are the options uh, for the intervention that you have to do, the strategy you're going to use. 